What's up everyone? Welcome back to my channel, Mas Masa. Today, I have a very overdue video, but better late than never, right? If you're like me, you're still lagging it on putting up your Christmas tree. I know I've seen so many of you already have it all up like two months ago or something. But if you're still looking for some Christmas tree ornaments or just some decor for around the house to make it Latino festive, well then I have a few products for you. Today I'm only focusing on Christmas tree ornaments to help you decorate your awesome tree. <laughs> ornaments that I'm going to share with you guys I got last year and I thought I'd share it with you guys again because I do see that it they are being promoted on Instagram so that means that they probably have them for sale so the first one is from chic party goods it is this cute snowflake and it has a conchita a pink conchita with a little bow and I noticed that the ones she has this year also have a coffee cup or mug and it's super duper cute so if this is something that would fit your Christmas tree hit her up I'll leave her Instagram information down below so you can get this cute cute ornament moving on to the next one look how cute this ornament is Inside there's snowflakes, conchitas, like four different colors, and a puerquito all on this cute little plate. Can it get any cuter than this? No. Well, maybe. This is something you definitely have to have on your Christmas tree. Look how cute this is. Definitely a conversation starter if you have a Christmas party or something like that. This definitely would be cool. And look at the snow shakes. Hope I didn't destroy it. I've seen some trees that are really, really cute and it's like this concha thing because you know, that's like the end thing. Well, it's been like the end thing for quite some time now. And to add to that festive conchita Christmas tree, this cute ornament from Lily Bun Designs. They actually made me a garland with conchitas and little cute mugs. I think I'm going to pull that out and use it on my Christmas tree as well. So if you have it, let me know how you use it. Tag me on a picture on Instagram or wherever it is that you post it. But definitely if you want to keep your tree very concha-like, definitely check them out. Uh, they have this cute, cute, cute conchita. Up next, I have a very cute quetzalito ornament. This is the traditional bird of Guatemala, but look how cute it is. Look at that. As soon as I saw it, I knew I had to have it. I love the bright green and this little bell on top that just gives it that extra festive touch. It's gonna look so cute on my tree. Can't wait to sport it. Like I said, I don't have my tree yet. I know I'm like behind, but guys, sooner or later, I'll get it, okay? So this one is from The Happy Skull Studio. All these ornaments I've seen on Instagram, so I know that they are probably still out there, so make sure you get your hands on them. All of these ones have caught my attention, and look at this, guys. This little Christmas piñata, like, okay, this reminds me like of posadas or parties, like, Christmas parties, New Year's parties. The kids would break piñatas during the holidays and this is perfect for my tree. Just a little reminder of my childhood, but look how colorful and just so pretty it looks. This is from Stick On Arts and I also ordered this super cute ornament. It's a little angel made out of corn husks and those are obviously husks that you use for the tamales. Son hojas de tamal. It has this gold detailing all around and it just stands out beautifully. Look at that. The next ornaments are personalized and I think they're great to start creating memories with your family, maybe getting a new ornament every year, just that identifies the year or, you know, is super personal to your family. Uh, these particular ones are made from Silvia Crafty Hands and she made this really cool one for Abuela and I, for Abuela's kitchen. It's great to take out a memory uh, and place it on your tree every year. I have this other one. Uh, this is from the movie Up. And this was in 2014. 
and uh, that was my favorite movie at the time. Uh, I de identified with their story, so it was really, really cool to get this uh, ornament for my tree. She also has these felt ornaments, and this is a Frida head, uh, and it has all these cute flowers with some glitter on it. It's great to have personalized ornaments on your tree just to make it extra special each time you take them out during the holidays. Last but not least, I have this ornament. It's not really an ornament, but I thought it would make for a great piece on my Christmas tree. These are actually items that Glamlindo Artesania has in her store. And I usually see her hanging them on her purses or on the bags that she has for sale. I took these all off bags that I've gotten from her or that she's gifted me. And I think they're gonna make for great ornaments, don't you guys think? So if you have one of these attached to a bag or anything, you can always pull them off and place on your tree. Your Christmas ornaments don't necessarily have to be Christmas ornaments. They can be items from around the house. <coughs> Just like this. I even have a flower that I use for decor and I think it would look really cool, which gave me an idea of making more flowers in different colors and placing them all over the tree. So just use your imagination to create ornaments from things that you have around the house. It doesn't have to be very expensive to put your tree together. These are just some ideas, flowers, handmade flowers. Um, items from things you already have uh, to create that tree that you really want. Um, I even have this, which is a keychain, and I, I'm gonna use it to put it on my tree. I don't see anything wrong with that. I think it's gonna match very well on what I have envisioned for my tree, a very Latino inspired Christmas tree. I even got this at Target, believe it or not. Look at this nopalito, isn't it? super cute. It's nice and like glittery and shiny. Um, and of course, I know you guys have seen these in my last video. These are really, really cool as well. Uh, so I can't wait to put my Christmas tree together. Well, that's all I have for you guys today. These are the ornaments that I've purchased throughout the week or weeks. I had been waiting for some and they hadn't arrived. So I was just waiting to get all of them so that I can show and share with all of you guys these amazing Christmas ornaments. And even after your Christmas is over, you can always use these items for different decor or events or just little parties. I mean, look at You can use this as decor anywhere you want. These items can be multi-purpose and just great to create an atmosphere. Well guys, I just wanted to share with you guys all these ornaments. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you liked any of the items that you saw, make sure that you hit them up. I'll leave all their information down below. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram. I also have a blog where I share a lot of family stories. I'll leave all the information, like I said, down below. Make sure you subscribe to my channel if you haven't yet. And thank you so much for the love and support. Thank you for watching and we'll see you guys in the next one. Peace, Latina in the house.